Hello friends, welcome. In this video I'm going to work with the forgot password. So here if we go to the login, we have this forgot password and right now nothing happens. This, But if I click here, I want to go to the to navigate to the forgot password route and then to have a form and I have prepared this form here. And then when we click, we need to send the forgot password and I'm going to use the mytrap.io. So if you have mytrap.io uh, account, okay, if you don't have, go to this mytrap.io and create an account and cop select here in the drop down the Laravel and copy this code here and navigate in your .env of Laravel backend project and paste it here. I have done that. Okay, and then if you go to the routes out.php, we have here the forgot password as you can see and the reset password. So we need to send a post request to this forgot dash password. And if we click here and open on the store, we are looking here for the email. So we need to send the email here and then is going to return a status, what status we have here. Okay, so let's close and let's open the front end now. And the first thing I'm going to create a component and then create the route for the forgot password and add the link here. So let's say here inside the components, new component, and I'm going to name it uh forgot password like this and then let's say v setup and in the template i'm going to paste this form select all copy and paste it here okay then let's go inside the routes index.js and i'm going to copy this one and paste it down there the path is going to be forgot dash password. You can uh, change if you'd like. The name is going to be forgot password. And the component also is going to be forgot password save this and close let's go inside the login because here we have this link and yeah we are not using anchor tags we are going to use the router link here and not ref but two and we need to go to the slash forgot password save come here and let's click Let's refresh first and let's click here. Yeah, we have forgot password and we have this uh, four. Okay, next, what we need to do is let's go to this forgot password and I'm going to import the ref from view. Import a ref from view and I'm going to create a constant for the email here. Const email is going to be equal with a ref and initially an empty string and in the input we need to add the v model email here I, I already added that i have in here so v model email but you can add in the input the v model email here okay next when we click the this submit i want to uh, send a post request to the backend so for that the logic is going to be inside the store so let's open the out store and here in the actions i'm going to create a new one i'm going to say async and let's name it handle uh, forgot password i'm 
like this and let's here we need the email let's add the email there and what we need to do we need to wait axios dot post is going to be post request and the url is slash forgot password like this and we need to add also the email here so let's say email with the email we have we expected okay and for now let's say something like this save and let's open the forgot password and let's import now the store and let's use this handle forgot password so import the use house store from and go up slash stores slash out I'm going to create a constant out store so we need to have the object of the use out store and in the form I'm going to say on submit call the out store dot uh, handle forgot password and we need to add the email here and let's also add dot prevent here and save it okay let's open the inspect element go to the console here and let's clear and let's add the test example.com click uh, submit and let's go to the network yeah we send a post request and we have emailed your password reset link so it's get back a status with this string okay let's go now to the email and yeah we can see we have the email here reset password and if you see down there here is the link or if we click here we have the password reset we don't have that route but this is coming directly from the backend and then we have a token here with the email which is our email we typed okay so then we need to check for the email and for the token and uh, change the password but let me just show you one more thing and this is not only for this form but for the other forms also so if i send again the submit pending and yeah we have back but if i click again now we have for choo choo we have a message please uh, wait before we try because we are going to try too many times very often and we are not showing the error here but the same if we go to the uh, login and just i'm going to send without email or password yeah we have a uh, login for choo choo and we need to work with the uh, errors the same for the register so let's clear here and yeah we have errors but we are not showing so we need to show the errors with that we are going to work in the next video so errors for the register login and for the forgot password also okay friends that's it about this video we sent the reset password and i hope you enjoy if you like don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video all the best and see you in the next one thank you very much